there you two, this is Mrs Ferguson and I'm here to tell you about your next computing lesson. So I hope you've all really been enjoying taking some pictures with your digital camera. Um, this week I would like you to carry on uh, taking another picture but before you do, what I'd like you to do is go onto the school website and have a look at our, this week's PowerPoint for photography. So it's called false photography, so this week you'll be looking to recognise when a photograph is fake when it has been photoshopped or altered to make it look a specific way. So have a look at this PowerPoint. It's going to ask you to take a look at some pictures which are on the plan. I've had to put them on the plan for you to have a look at. So there are four sets of pictures here. Have a look and discuss with someone at home, maybe your adults or perhaps you've got a sibling at home, which one you think is real, which one you think is fake and how you think it's been altered. How has it been edited and changed? That's the first thing you're going to do. The next thing you're going to do is to stop at slide 12 on this PowerPoint and it's going to give you a checklist, a checklist of things for you to do. So what it wants you to do is to take another photograph of something that you like. It could be yourself, it could be your parents, it could be your pet uh, or maybe one of your uh, dolls or toys. So it could be something like that. Have a, take a photograph, go through the checklist, changing and editing the things that it tells you to. Use the software that we used last week, I think it was called Pixlar. If you use the same software, just put your photograph up there and follow the checklist. See how you can change a photo to make it look completely and utterly different. That will be your task for this week. So I do hope you enjoy your photography this week and hopefully I'll see you again soon. Okay. Bye for now.